On a winter night in 373 BCE, the Greek city of Helice vanished. Ancient writers described the disaster with chilling clarity. A violent tremor, followed by the earth splitting open beneath the streets. A roar rose from beneath the ground, and then a great wave surged inland, swallowing the city whole. By sunrise, Helic, once the powerful center of the Achaean League, had disappeared beneath the sea. Fishermen claimed they could still see its streets and temples shimmering beneath the surface for centuries afterward. For two millennia, Helica became a cautionary tale, often cited as the real-world inspiration for the myth of Atlantis. Yet its exact location remained lost until the late 20th century, when Greek archaeologists Dora Katsinopoulou and Stephen Soder began a systematic survey of the Gulf of Corinth. Their findings stunned the academic world. Helike had indeed been destroyed by an earthquake and tsunami, but not once. Twice, sediment cores taken from ancient seabeds revealed two distinct destruction layers, one corresponding to the famous collapse in 373 BCE, and a much older one dating to around 2400 BCE. This earlier Helike, an urban settlement from the early Bronze Age, also suffered sudden subsidence, followed by inundation. Geological analysis showed the plain lay atop highly unstable soil prone to liquefaction, where the ground temporarily behaves like a liquid during major earthquakes. Both cities, built centuries apart, were claimed by the same hidden force beneath their foundations. What makes Helic extraordinary is not simply its destruction, but the precision with which ancient sources described it. Passages from Diodorus Siculus, Pausanias, and Strabo mirror the geological evidence almost exactly strange animal behavior before the quake, the ground rolling like waves, and seawater drawing back before the final surge. These accounts, long dismissed as dramatic exaggerations, now read like accurate eyewitness descriptions of a seismic event modern science understands only too well. The rediscovery of Heliki reveals a civilization struck down twice by the same ancient fault line. Its history written not only in myth, but in the layers of earth that buried it. Perhaps Atlantis was not a single city, but a pattern. Cultures rising and collapsing along the edges of forgotten seas. And perhaps Helik is the reminder that history, like the ground beneath our feet, can shift without warning. Hi, it's Chini. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, follow, or subscribe to get notified when a new story drops. It's also the best way to support our channel.